I've noticed you started to partake in activities in which you should not be, and this concerns me. You were instructed to seek out the demon masters who have surfaced, destroy them, and return. But it appears to me you're doing quite the opposite. I'm doing all I can. I have a few leads I'm following, and I've been trying to be as discreet as possible. Discreet? I'm sorry, but your definition of the word is far different from mine. And if you were following leads, why were you attending a high school party? It doesn't make any sense to me. But I'm warning you, Avery. If you don't want me to interfere, then you do your job, and you do it right. We're not here to play games. We have a much greater purpose. Oh, and Avery? Yes? Don't challenge my authority again. If you do, it'll be your last. Understood? Understood. <sighs> this is it. There's a strong aura pulling me in. This place? But it's abandoned. Abandoned or not, we have to check it out. About time you got here! I've been trying to lure you in for hours! Jules! It's good to see you again, Leon. It's been a while. Jester. It amazes me that you still have so much strength, seeing as you were nearly killed the last time we met. It takes a lot more than a few stabs to the chest to kill me. <laughs> I'll be sure to do much more than that this time. <laughs> Now that is what I call power! And every day I have this target to finish what I started Instead I quickly grow disheartened and restless So from the night I say what matters my own Shattered color confetti scattered all through the carpet And sure I'm in the works of recording a hit Of course these double standards left me stranded and sorry Sorry, I didn't mean to ruin your night. If you if you just let me explain. I don't care what it was you were trying to do, and I don't care what you have to say. You ruined my party and you embarrassed me. <sighs> it seems my class is getting smaller and smaller every day. Hopefully everyone is alright, but let's move on. I hope you all are working on your assignments. If you haven't heard, I've moved the due date back, so you'll have additional two days to work on it. As for today, we'll be looking at the opposite side of things. We'll be focusing on more of Chapter 6, which consists of different types of demons. Luckily, the school has found an expert to come and speak with us. Please welcome Mr. Icarus Vaughn. Good morning, class. What happened? When I arrived, Jester was attempting to drain Jules' celestial energy, and Leon was unconscious. Wait, Jester? Yes, I couldn't believe it either, but it was him. That can't be. We banished him into darkness. There's no way he could have escaped. I bounded him with restraints only an angel of the highest could break. 
But Lucifer is an angel, isn't he? There would have been no way for Lucifer to reach him. We need to get to the bottom of this. And quick. Persephone! Is that really you? I really enjoyed your lecture. It was very insightful. Thank you, um... Myra. Thank you, Myra. So, I understand you're an author. It's strange that I've never heard of you. I've read almost every book in the library besides the one we're currently reading and a few nonfiction books. Well, you see, I haven't published my book just yet due to unexpected delays. I mostly do seminars and things of that nature. Oh, okay. I'll definitely check it out. It sounds like a really great read from what you described. Indeed it is. <sighs> well, I have to head to my next class. Nice meeting you, Mr. Vaughn. Is it really you? My, my sweet, sweet Persephone. Persephone. Beating you never felt so good. Coming from a person who said they didn't know how to bowl? Besides, I, I wasn't even trying. I'm a quick learner and you nearly knocked out the guy playing next to us. I lost my grip and my wrist was a little stiff and uh... Don't you go making excuses. You just got your butt whooped by a girl. Just own it. <laughs> Fine, I'm owning it. That's a good boy. Give credit where it's due. I will, along with her prize. Which is... How dare you soil her with your vile lips! You will pay dearly, I promise you that! Jules! Relax. Your home, Jules, is safe. She's resting in the other room. Just, he, he attacked us. <sighs> I know. Jules contacted me telepathically when she saw he was there. I could have taken him. You're still too weak from your last encounter. But don't worry, you'll have your revenge soon enough. We all will. Myra, please wait! I really need to talk to you. Fine, if you won't speak to me, at least listen. Look, I'm not sure how well you're going to take this, but... Avery's not who he says he is. This whole thing with Laura being attacked and studying demons... It's all real, Myra. It's no coincidence. Now, whether you choose to believe me, it's completely up to you, but please... Please stay away from him. It's dangerous, and I'm really sorry for ruining your party. It wasn't my intent. You know I never do anything like that without a reason. Are you done? No, I don't want you to think I'm jealous of him, because I'm not. We've been friends for years, and you know me better than that. If you'll allow me, I'd like to show you something later on tonight. Can you come by? I'll think about it. That's all I can ask you to do. Oh, and Myra, please don't let him be the reason our friendship ends. Hello, Anna. Just, Jessabeth? What are you doing here? It's broad daylight. Oh, please. You act as though demons are vampires. Humans can't see me unless I reveal myself. You know why I'm here. It's time for you to hold up your end of the bargain. Please. I've made a decent life here and I... Uh, uh, uh. You made a deal, and you can't turn back now. I beg you! I'm happy here! <laughs> and what about my happiness? I won't go! You can't make me! <laughs> if you don't, I'll just hunt you down for the rest of your miserable life. I'll... Uh, I'll be there, please. <laughs> 
That's a good girl. I've come up with an idea. If we can lure them both to a central location, we can ambush them and drive them back into the darkness. This time, we make sure to drain them of all celestial energies, leaving only enough for them to breathe. But we don't know if they've reached their full potential. J just as Power's levels were high and growing when we encountered him. It was, but if he was after my celestial energy, that means he hasn't regained all of it. Samara mentioned there were two Demon Masters. Where's the other one? Why would only one be attacking people and the other sitting idle? It doesn't make sense. Unless they're working together. There's no way two Demon Masters would work together. They have no reason to. Unless they're related. Jester had a sister in a previous life. What was her name? I, I can't... Jezebeth. Now that's a problem. A big problem. But wait, the demon released in the graveyard. You don't think... Trevor. What are we doing here? I need you to witness something. I'm not sure you'll like it, but it's necessary for your training. What's necessary? <sighs> Must you ask so many questions? Well, you dragged me out here in the middle of the night without telling me where we're going. I think you can handle a few questions. I need you to witness me strengthening my powers. And the only way I can do that is if I drain that of another's. You don't mean me, do you? <laughs> of course not. You're not strong enough. Then who? Miss Barnett! What are you doing here? Are you one of them? I... I'm so sorry, Trevor. Of course she's not one of us. Then what is she? She's a medium like you, Trevor. But she's been around much, much longer. We're talking decades here, people. But why is she here? Are you gonna kill her? How else would I gain her powers? I can't let you do this! She doesn't deserve to die! There's nothing you can do, Trevor. See, she's bound by blood contract. If she doesn't comply with the terms of the contract, uh, she'll die anyway. Holy shit! What were you doing in the bushes? I have a front door, you know. Sorry, I just wanted to see you. Also, there's something I need to talk to you about. Oh, okay. There's something you need to know about me. You don't have a girlfriend, do you? <laughs> no, uh, no, not at, at least not yet. But, uh, we're off topic. Th thing is... Sorry, I... One second. What?! Avery! Where are you going? What's going on? 